An apartment building on Northeast Gleason. Brent, what have you learned? Hey, Jenny and Trevor, good morning to you. I'm standing on Northeast Gleason right now. You can see this large pickup. It's a Toyota Tacoma uh, Tundra, actually, we are just told. Uh, very large, heavy-duty pickup, and you can see it's uh, smashed right into one of these lower units of a two-story apartment complex. This is the Fairway apartment complex here on Northeast Gleason, uh, just uh, in between 122nd and 127th. That is the road closure as well here. You can see the power company, they just arrived. You can also see down in the distance there that uh, dangling utility pole. We understand that that may be a uh, power pole slash uh, phone line pole. So the uh, crews are out here now looking at it. Uh, but uh, just found out from Portland police that the driver of this pickup that crashed was heading uh, westbound on Gleason here when he actually fell asleep. According to Portland police, he, he did a lot of damage here. He went over the curb, uh, took out the apartment sign, then took out the uh, utility pole here, then crashed into another pickup, sent that pickup flying several feet, then ended up in the apartment complex. Despite all of that, Trevor and Jenny, no injuries in all of this. The driver not being arrested, not being cited. We are told by Portland police that it's likely going to be his insurance company that's going to have to pay for all this damage. As for the apartment complex themselves, well, they are in a bit of a pickle because no cars can actually get out because of the lines that are now down. So Portland police are working with them, trying to figure out the best case scenario to get them out. We know the utility crews are here working on this situation. Uh, we can tell you Gleason is closed again from 1 to 2 to 127th and will be for several hours. Back to you. Yeah.